Sir, in every race, why is the woman shorter than man? What is God's design? You see, there is a meaning in God's design. In every race, whether it is Japanese race or British or American or Red Indian or African or Indian or Chinese or Mongolian, whatever it be, invariably the woman is shorter than the man. And there is a meaning for it. Man is born to take upon himself physical risks to earn money and to save the family. He has more physical responsibilities than the woman. He goes out of the house, he faces the challenges of life, he is uh, forced, he is compelled to take upon himself physical challenges like cart pulling or carrying a heavy rice bag or uh, climbing up a tall building, painting, uh, all sorts of physical risks. He takes up, he doesn't hesitate to do it. So physically he has to be more fit, so he is tall. Whereas take up the case of a woman, she is more fit for making up a home. He fits into the role of a homemaker more uh, easily or more aptly. Say, nurturing the family, giving birth to children, bringing them up, showing motherly love to the family, being a source of consolation to the uh, hard-working husband. So, these responsibilities fall upon her shoulders. And that is uh, perhaps the reason why man is taller than a woman. Further, in physical union also, this height difference is... Uh, very correct and uh, mm, our elders have said in Shastras regarding this uh, sex that this height difference is, a, is very conducive in physical union and that is the ideal proportion. So, there is a meaning in the difference of heights.